Hi there. I'm Cheryl Rainfield. I'm the author of Scars, Hunted, Stained, and two high-low books for teens. I've heard a lot of advice um, for writers. And these are some of the things that I think are the most helpful and most important. And one is to read a lot. A read in your genre because you get to see what other writers are doing and it becomes like a conversation. But also you can learn technique from other writers. You can go, aha, that's how they did that. I want to do that too. And also it helps refill your creative well. Uh, if you're just writing and writing, you can get burnt out or really tired. And reading, at least for me, it... it it helps me remember why I want to write that uh, that wonderful feeling when you're reading a book that is perfect to you or that just makes you feel happy or good or stronger. Uh, so reading helps. And also get feedback from other writers. Join a critique group online or in person. Just make sure you get feedback. You can learn so much by listening to how other writers critique each other and your own work, and you also learn by critiquing. It really helps your, your writing improve, and we need it even after we're published to get feedback again for each new book. I find it incredibly helpful. And I also think it's important to write about what you care about. Readers will respond because they feel that you're caring about it. But also, writing a book is a long process. You write it, and then you edit it, and then you edit it again. And to keep your passion and your energy, your motivation up, it really helps that you write something that you care about. And then also, when it's published, you have even more mm, good feeling about it because it's something that you care about. And I also think it's important to write emotional truths into your fiction. We hear a lot about write what you know, and I think that's good advice. But if you're writing what you care about and what you, what you know emotionally, readers again are going to respond more. We sense when someone, even in writing, when someone is speaking honestly from an emotional level or when they're lying. And I think readers close books much faster when it's, when it's not emotionally true. But when it is emotionally true, we're getting something that we need as a reader and it hooks the reader and it will help a reader stay in your book longer. So try writing from emotional truth. And those are my uh, little bits of advice for writing. I hope they help you. They help me. Take good care and keep writing.